Hey guys, it's Nurse Gwenny. Have you ever seen one of these out in the middle of a field somewhere and said to yourself, what in the leprechaun shack is that? Well, it's called a VOR or a very high frequency omnidirectional radio. And it helps people who are up in the sky get safely down on the ground when we can't see the ground. So most HEMS program, helicopter EMS, programs in the United States fly by VFR or visual flight rules. That means the cloud deck has to be at least a thousand feet up off the ground. And we have to be able to see for three miles in front of us and be able to visualize the ground the whole time while we're flying. But there are some flight programs and all commercial airlines are IFR or instrument flight rules. And that means they don't fly by seeing the ground and the terrain around them. Excuse my hair getting nasty in the rain right now. They fly by instruments that guide them. And this is one of the things that helps to guide them down to a runway at an airport. So if you ever see one of these, you're probably, there goes a plane now, within a mile or 30 miles of an airport. because we have these speckled on a pattern leading to a runway. And how this works, it emits a radio frequency, kind of like FM radio, and it's almost like playing Marco Polo with the planes in the sky. And so this guy, 24 hours a day, all the time, is constantly releasing Marco, and a plane flying through the sky is saying Polo and trying to find it. And then it's, it talks to the, the aircraft computer, and then it lines it up with this VOR, and it sends a message and says, okay, for here, you need to be 2,500 feet off the ground and you are 12 miles from one runway 18 or whatever runway it is. And so the pilot knows to be at that certain altitude or if it's got autopilot on the plane is operating it by itself. And then it fly, keeps flying forward in the direction that it's supposed to at the descent that has been predetermined by these. And it will catch them in line with the next one. It'll say, okay, at this one, you need to be at a thousand feet. And you keep following these little dotted lines, these VORs until it guides you in to a runway if you can't see it with your eyes. So next time you see one of these, you know it's not a leprechaun house, it's a VOR.